Now, what happens when we present an article? Yeah, we want to create an instance of a coordinator and uh, push it. So the coordinators are creating their own children in this case, yeah. right? And there's a problem here because if we need to add more dependencies to a child coordinator, we need to either update the dependency here. Let's say we have a coordinator that needs a tab bar controller. What are you going to do? We're going to add now a, a tab bar controller here. And then you break all the other coordinators right? because we need to inject and all this tab everywhere. That's the problem with the protocols. So ideally, a coordinator should not be responsible for creating its children. Because if it is, you will be coupled with all the dependencies of its children as well. And this may overcomplicate the dependency injection part. And then you need to resort to using singletons because it will be a nightmare to pass dependencies everywhere. So I think we can extract this as well into a separate Coordinator. Coordinator, no, into a separate class. Just like we separated the tracking into a class, mm -hmm. we can also separate the instantiation of the children into another class. We could create a coordinator. Because this is a responsibility, right? Like the 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 creation. Um, it, it's an actual responsibility, and you don't want to mix those two there. That's the problem. So let's say to present an offer, what do we need? We need a navigation controller. And we need the machine name, the offers repository, the event tracking, the tracking origin. So where does this all come from? Yeah, from those two protocols, uh, has, offer reposit has offers repository and offers tracking. Mm, OK. Okay, so here we have access to the events tracking and we need to carry those dependencies everywhere. Okay. So the event here is when you present a native ad, it will create a native ad coordinator, start it and append it as a child. Okay. And if you present an article, you will create in the coordinator, start and as a child. So the only thing that changes is the instantiation, but starting and appending is the same everywhere. So maybe we can create an interface that creates exactly this logic. So something like make child coordinator or a widget 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 and it should return a coordinator for example it's not the logic of instantiating now moved here so the factory should only have one responsibility, instantiating objects. The trackers should only have the responsibility of tracking events, right? And we separate those responsibilities. So here, if it's article, we return an article coordinator. And then we need to figure out the dependencies here. What else? If it's a native ad, we need to return a native coordinator. And if it's an offer, we need to return an offer coordinator. Now they can have different dependencies of affecting the parent coordinator. If we want to change the dependency here, we change it here without affecting the native ads controller or the parent or the article controller. Okay. We need a tracking origin. 
machine name. So this comes from the widget, right? Uh, yeah. So we're in the protocol. What is these dependencies here? What is the type of the dependencies? Uh, for article coordinator, is, yeah. Um, article coordinator uh, requires rep all repositories. So that's the dependency here. Mm. So it carries all the dependencies, but it only needs one, the articles repository. But these dependencies exposes all the repositories, right? Yeah. Okay. So now, oh, and I see, and you would provide all the dependencies here because if there's a new dependency you don't need to change your composition right yeah you wouldn't have to change everything but now that we have moved the instantiation to another object we can define exactly what we need here in the initializer so if he needs an article repository we can say we want an article repository mm -hmm. makes sense that so makes we don't sense. need to carry this dependency everywhere but let's do one thing at a time because i think this will be a big change here yeah okay so somehow we need a navigation controller, dependencies, event tracking. So where do we instantiate the objects right now? Where do we instantiate the dependencies? Uh, what, what do you mean? Uh, who creates it? Uh, who creates those dependencies? Uh, the, they are created on uh, like up, yeah, here in the app delegate. Okay, at the start point. Good. So we need all of this to create the repositories container. Yeah. Okay, I guess we can get all those dependencies here instead of creating them inside this application, the finish launching with options, we can move all of them here. Factory. And this can be a lazy lazy var, and then we can load them only when needed. And we have access to all of them. Oh, just the name is different. This is a repository container, repository container and offers repository. It will be oh, a part it, of repository. Oh, 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 yeah, all this. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now we know the tracking origin. And the navigation controller. Yeah. Where do we create the navigation controller? And navigate. Mm -hmm. In the flow coordinator? Uh, yeah main coordinator or in the child coordinator coordinator creates its own navigation controller um, yeah in this case uh, yeah probably in the initializer oh yeah yeah oh right here yes okay so they create and manage their own navigation controller okay so in this case, since the navigation controller varies per instance, we can use method injection. Like this. Now we can either make one method for each root, and this could be a make feed child coordinator, and then the tracking origin will always be feed, for example. Mm -hmm. Navigation controller. Now we have all the dependencies we need. Yes. We never use the offer. Oh, let's use the offer here. Native add and article. And if we cannot, we return new. Okay. So instantiation now is moved to the factory. Now, this factory can also create the main flow. 
do that. Make main flow. So factory. Make sense? Yeah. Okay. Now let's make sure that the coordinators don't create their child coordinators anymore. Because then we don't need to pass the dependencies everywhere. So if this coordinator needs three child coordinators immediately at creation time, it can inject them at this dependencies. A feed coordinator, article list coordinator, and offer list coordinator. Yeah, just um, change the equals to columns. Whoops. Correct right now. That's it. So that's now the creation away. of the coordinator is moved to the factory. Makes sense so far, what we're we doing? Yeah, it makes sense. Let's have a look at the app flow coordinator. Uh -huh. It never uses the repository container. We can remove it. The event tracking. Hey, first one doesn't have these dependencies anymore. Gone. So when we move instantiation away from the coordinator, we decouple the, the co coordinator from its children dependencies. Yeah. So we don't need to carry that those dependencies everywhere. 